I uploaded a video recently showing you how you can buy Shiba Inu coin on Binance. If you did buy it and now you're wondering how you could sell it if it appreciates in value, then watch this video because I will show you how you can sell it and withdraw the money into your local bank account, irrespective of your country. Also, if you are in Nigeria or any country where there is a crypto ban, this video will help you learn how you can withdraw your money. Please consider subscribing and turning on this notification bell. Now, let's dive right into the video. The first step is to come to Binance.com. Okay, um, for you to sell Shiba Inu coins, that means you already have um, a Binance account and that means you already have some um, Shiba coins in your Binance um, uh, account. Okay, so if I look here, if you look here, you can see I have some Shiba coins, over 300,000 Shiba coins already here. Okay, good. So if you don't have a Binance account, I would, I would recommend you you create one i'm gonna leave a link um, in the description below this video so that um, you can create a binance account okay and uh, i'll also leave a video again showing you how to uh, create a binance account okay now let's say you bought this um uh, coin because i did a video previously showing you how you can buy this coin let's say you bought this coin and you're wondering how would you sell this coin let's say it appreciates in value and you want to sell this coin how are you going to sell it very simple once you have created your account and you're on your binance dashboard like this what you're going to do is you come over to this place and click this thing here once you click it it's going to show you this you come to where it says trades okay you click that button okay so once we click that and then you click where it says classic so once you click that it's gonna load now it's loaded okay so you can see it's fully loaded now so this is what you're going to do what we're going to do now is we're gonna sell the shiba coins okay so to sell shiba you click this place where you have uh, currency pairs where we have btc slash usdt so if i click that okay um it shows um this search option here so i'll be able to search shiba so i typed um uh, shib and it's showing me our uh, currency pairs here you can see shib slash usdt let me kind of like zoom that in okay good you can see we have shib slash usdt we have shib slash busd now these are the two uh currency pairs you can uh, used to buy sheep or sell sheep for or exchange sheep for okay so um, for the purpose of this video I'm gonna use uh, let's say we use USDT for instance you click that currency pair so once you click that now yeah so once you click that it's gonna show up here you can see it says sheep slash USDT so once sheep slash USDT is showing so you come over to this place you can see where it says buy here then you click where it says sell okay once it's, it, it, uh, it shows sell then you come here and look here you can say it says sell sheep now if you look closely here it shows you the quantity of sheep you already have and then so um to avoid complicating things if you're an experienced uh, crypto currency trader you might want to set your limits and put your stop limit and all of that but as a beginner okay very simply just click uh, market okay once you click market okay then you'll be able to sell your shiba coins all you just have to do is to drag this button here drag it to let's say you want to sell 34 percent of your quantity this quantity of sheep here or maybe you want to sell a hundred percent so just drag it to the percentage you want to sell and notice as i'm dragging this it's showing you the quantity of shiba you are selling so at 47 percent you're selling ab um, about 15,000 shiba okay and then this is the uh, usdt here you can see price showing, showing you um your usdt here so this means you're selling sheep or shiba inu coins for usdt so all you just need to do is to click this sell button and then your coins will be sold okay so i'm basically trying to um show you how you can do this i am not selling shiba in this video but i'm pretty much showing you how you can do it if you want to uh, sell it so that's just how to do it if you want to sell your shiba uh inu coins okay so now once your shiba coins have been sold that means you now have usdt okay so that means you have usdt so the next thing is 
to exchange USDT for your local currency so that you can withdraw into your bank account. Okay, so what you're going to do is once you've sold this, if you go to your wallet, let me show you something. Yeah, if you come to your mobile app and come over here, down here where it says wallet and click wallet. So if you did sell that ship, let's say you, so you sold that ship, then when you come here, you will see USDT. It's going to show you, it's going to show somewhere here, showing you, you can see the currencies you have here. You can see the ship, you can see the BUSD, uh, BNB and all of that. You can see all the currency pairs here. You are going to definitely see the USDT. DT and then it's going to show you the quantity just like we have SHIB here and showing me the quantity BUSD showing me the quantity I have then the USDT you just bought okay remember you sold SHIBA okay to get USDT the USDT is going to show here and it's going to show you the quantity if it is not showing here you can search it okay you can click that thing here and then um, search okay basically so um, now, if the USDT is showing here, the next thing is to sell the USDT, okay? You exchange it for your local currency, okay? So you sell it, um, so you go back to the desktop version. And just to remind you, I'm doing everything on my phone, okay? So basically what I'm doing is I'm using a Chrome browser. I turn it to desktop version, and then I... Uh, search uh, login to Binance so it's gonna give me a, a wider view to sell okay so uh, back to our desktop version okay so what's happening now is that um, we want to sell uh, the USDT we just bought okay so you click this place again you go to that uh, currency pairs you click that so once we click that then this time around we are going to sell USDT for our local currency okay so this time around we searched usdt we want to um, sell it for our local currency so you're going to look at all these currency pairs let me kind of like zoom it in again okay so this time you're going to look for your currency pair okay i'm in nigeria so basically i'm going to go with this one that says usdt slash ngn okay so if you are in great britain you're going to search usdt slash gbt if you are in the us or whatever currency you're using okay so you're going to look for your currency pair slash i mean you're going to look for usdt slash your currency so if i click usdt slash ngn um then it shows usdt slash ngn okay so you can see it here Good, you can see here USDT slash NGN. So this is my currency pair now. So this means I want to sell my USDT so that I can get NGN uh, uh, fiat currency. Okay, so I want to get my NGN. Okay, so all I have to do is to come here again. Okay, so uh, click this sell button here. Good, so that means I am selling USDT. You can see it says it here, sell USDT. Okay, again, you drag this button to um, to where you want to sell it. Okay, so let's say I want to sell 100%. So I drag it up to that point. So that's 100% of it. Okay, good. So that means I want to sell it. And then it tells me the price here. Okay, and then once I click sell, once I click sell, okay, I'm going to sell USDT. And then again, in my spot wallet, I'm going to see my NGN balance or whatever currency you use. So, so if I come to my spot wallet again, so you're going to see NGN. It's going to reflect here, okay? So if your NGN is reflecting here or your currency, whatever currency you're using, Australian dollar, whatever, once it reflects here, all you just need to do is to click on it to withdraw into your local bank account. For example, uh, let's say it was showing here. Okay, let's say, let me use this BUSD as an example to show you what I mean. Once you click it, it's going to show you this face. All you have to do is to click where it says withdraw. So you'll be able to withdraw into your local bank account. And mind you, for you, be, for you to be able to withdraw into your local bank account, that means you already have your, your bank details connected uh, to uh, Binance. Okay, if you go to your profile and your settings, you would have connected your bank to this platform so that way it will be easy for you to withdraw 
directly into your bank account. So this is how you can sell uh, Shiba Inu coins and then have it um, into your bank account. Follow the process. We sold it to get USDT. Once we had USDT, we then sold USDT to have our local currency. In my case, to have NGN. In your case, it could be AUD, your Australian dollar, it could be the British pounds, it could be whatever currency, okay? Now, but this only works for uh, people who are in countries where there is no cryptocurrency ban, okay? There are some countries that are not allowed to withdraw directly from uh, Binance into their bank account. For example, in Nigeria here, you can't do this. You can't withdraw um, your NGN or your currency into your local bank account if you try that your account is going to be flagged okay so what you're going to do if you are in nigeria or in any country like that with such restrictions you are going to utilize the power of um, p2p okay so what you're going to do basically is you are going to exchange your you're going to click this transfer click transfer Okay, you're going to uh, uh, um, send the NGN you have in your spot wallet to your P2P wallet. Okay, let's say you came in here and it wasn't in this order. You can click this thing to have it switch. Okay, so we're switching. So we are selling from our spot wallet now to our P2P wallet. And then here it says BTC. You can change it and click that. Okay, since it was USDT, you look for USDT. Sorry, since it was NGN rather, we want to. I'm, I'm using you NGN since I'm in Nigeria. I can click NGN. Okay, so if you uh, you can just look for your currency here. Okay, so I like click NGN, the Nigerian naira. Okay, so I click that and then I'll click max. Okay, that's if I want to sell all my NGN. Okay, so I click max and then this thing is gonna turn yellow. I'm gonna click transfer. Once I do that. Then what happens is that if I click P2P, if I do that, I click P2P, then my I'm going to have NGN somewhere here. NGN is going to show here and then it's going to show me the value I have. Okay. So once that's the case, the next thing is to sell, sell, sell uh, the NGN. Okay. Uh, via this peer-to-peer -peer, uh, trading. Okay. So let's say I want to sell it. All I have to do is to click P2P here. Okay. So it's going to bring me to this platform here. So you can see all the currencies. So you can see BTC, BUSD, BNB, ETH, NGN, and all that. Okay. So in my case, I have NGN. I hope you're following my process. I have NGN. I'll click that NGN. Okay. I want to sell NGN. So if yours is not NGN, let's say it's any kind of other kind of currency, you're going to click this thing here up there. So it's going to show you all the currencies you have. Okay. So let's say uh, you yours is the AUD or let's say, let's kind of like go down. Uh, yeah. The GBP. Okay. The Great British Pound or the EUR, okay, European currency, Canadian dollar, whatever, whatever currency you are using, okay, just click that and then it's going to reflect here, okay, so, and then the next thing is you're going to see, you see it says buy here, it says sell, so you click sell, okay, that means you want to sell your uh, currency, okay, so, and then you're going to see all these guys here, they are the people that are willing to buy your local currency from you, so you can see all these guys, they want to buy your local currency from you. Now, if you look closely uh, here, it states the range they want to buy from. Okay. In my currency, they want to buy, this person wants to buy from uh, between 5,000 Naira to 400,000 and he's buying at 0 0.93. Okay. So that's how you, 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 you do this. So if I want to sell to this guy, all I have to do is to click sell. Okay, but before you sell, you need to watch what's happening here. If I click here, this person is gonna pay me. Um, um, let me click this first to show you. If I click that, then it shows me this. Okay, so I'm gonna enter the quantity of NG and I want to sell. Okay, and then once I enter the quantity, and then you can see I go down here. Now there's a special instruction here, it says bias payment method, NGN 
fiat balance. So this person is going to pay you from the NGN in his P2P wallet, okay, or the uh, GBP, Great British Pounds, in his um, P2P wallet or whatever currency you're using. So he wants to pay you from that. So that means uh, if I continue with this transaction, I'm not going to be credited. My account, my bank account is not going to be credited. Rather, I'm going to see the payment on my uh, uh, on my P2P NGN wallet or your P2P uh, GBP wallet or AUD wallet. You understand what I'm saying? So that's how that works. So if you don't like this uh, kind of payment method, if you want to, if you want physical physical cash into your bank account, so all you're going to do is um, you go back. So it's very important to know the payment method. Okay. So all these guys, this logo here means they are going to use their NGN fiat balance to pay you. NGN fiat balance or GBP fiat balance. So you go down here. Now this symbol means this person is going to pay you transferring directly into your bank account. So um, I've talked about I've talked about this P2P trading a lot. Make sure you watch some of my videos to understand this. I think I'm trying to do justice to it here. Okay, so let's say I click to this. I click here, click that. And then it opens again like that. So I fill in the value. You can see um, everything. This person is going to transfer. Uh, you can see that instruction is here. So he's going to do bank transfer. Okay. And then the payment window is within 45 minutes. Okay. What within 45 minutes. And this is the guy's destiny. So if I put in the details and click sell, the process is pretty much easy. The person is going to, your bank details your bank details okay is are going to be shown to the person and the person is going to go to uh, the bank to uh, pay in that uh, quantity you want to sell and then it's going to reflect in your account and once that happens you're going to release gn for the person so this is basically how you can sell your crypto and um, have it physically in your bank account or you have it in your spot um, your P2P wallet or spot wallet, okay? Uh, but mind you, before you can do this, you would have connected your bank details to Binance, okay? That's the only way this would be possible for you to do, guys. So basically, we have come to the end of this video. If you have any questions regarding what I've done or what I've said in this video, why not state them in the comment section? I'll be willing to answer and reply okay i have a video showing you how you can buy uh, shiba also if you've not seen that video i'll leave a link of that video in the description below this video is your guy ken is brixel bees signing out